Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. Question. How do I collect performance information for WebSphere Application Server? Access the WebSphere Integrated Solutions Console for the servers that you want to monitor. The Performance Monitoring Infrastructure, PMI, is used to identify and track key performance indicators for applications. Click Monitoring and Tuning. Click Performance Monitoring Infrastructure, PMI. Click a server name. Selecting the right performance indicators is an iterative process. Selecting the basic monitoring level is a good starting point. Enable PMI here and select the statistics in the boxes below. Select the appropriate monitoring level. Basic is a good starting point for determining performance indicators. The page also shows the information that is tracked. Select the basic monitoring option. Click Apply or OK. Save the changes. The selected level of monitoring will be in place when the server is started or restarted. The video will also show the other monitoring levels that can be selected. In cases where basic monitoring is not sufficient, an extended monitoring level might provide the needed level of information. Expand the Extended section to see the extended set of statistics. Enabling all statistics is not recommended, but might be reviewed to see the full range of information available. The Custom selection provides a convenient tree of selections. Click here to see the selection menus. The Custom category provides the granularity and the depth to monitor the key indicators. Click each category to look at the statistics that can be enabled. Enterprise beans often determine the overall response. JDBC statistics can be used as the indicators of the health of the application. JVM Runtime shows the overall health of the server. Once you make the selections and restart the server, you can use a performance viewer or enable logging. Logging is recommended as it consumes fewer resources and allows performance information to be reviewed multiple times. This screen shows the recommended starting selection. You can look at the current activity, but it is not recommended because live monitoring and network communications for the information might affect performance. Logging the information does not impose network load and is less disruptive to performance. Select this server to show the current activity and to allow some updates to the data collection properties. The application is not accessed yet, so statistics are not available. You can specify the location and the size of the log file in the Settings menu. The default values are fine for many applications, but they should be increased if the application is complex or if there is an increase in the time period. Otherwise, many log files need to be accessed to review the information. The name of the log file automatically includes the server name and the date stamp. A binary log output format is recommended. If XML is used as a log output format, the XML files will be compressed at the end of the collection period. Click here to start logging. 
logging is in process and other actions can be taken in the administrative console. This concludes the exercise of enabling the performance monitoring infrastructure. At the conclusion of the monitoring period, it is recommended that you reset the collected statistics to none or disable PMI. Select the application with PMI enabled. Select None as the currently monitored statistics set or clear the checkbox on Enable Performance Monitoring Infrastructure. Click Apply or OK. Save the changes. Use the administrative console to restart the server that was updated. Restart the server for the changes to take effect. The changes are saved when the server is restarted. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.